What is going on, everybody? I told you guys that I would be back for a gaming stream, and I am. Um. But I'm back. Um, I do have some stuff that I am going to talk about. So give me just one moment to shut my door. And we're going to start talking about some things. Because I do have an announcement. Um, and this is something that I've been pondering on for a very, very long time. Um, something that I've thought about not only today. No, 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 not just say like this has been in the works for several months that I kind of wanted to wait until the time was right to speak on what's going on. So I'm getting just a moment here to reset this but while we're waiting we are going to jump into a drift run here Let's see if we got any new word new tracks to download hopefully we do but there is a lot to talk about that I've been wanting to talk with you guys about that. Like I said, I've been truly thinking about this for a very, very, very long time now. And I just feel like this is something that, you know, needs to happen that I've been seriously considering. Which, and I know a lot of people aren't going to like this, but I've actually been considering and seriously thinking about it and looking into retiring from music and actually jumping back into doing my artwork full time. Because it's something that I'll be able to do privately. Um... It's not going to be for a while though. I am going to release this album and then after I drop this punk rock album that I'm working on. Um, that's when I will be hanging up the mic or putting it down and jumping back into my artwork. Because artwork is what I've been doing since I was born, dude. Like, I've been doing artwork since I could hold a crown. Like, dead ass. Like, I've done artwork my entire life. It's... It's what I know. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's something that I've always, always enjoyed doing. And I kind of want to get back into that and explore where I can take these new styles of art that are coming out. I just really want to pioneer that and see what I can do with it, you know? See what can come of my digital artwork and where I can take it, you know what I mean? Like, and I know what you're saying, but dude, like, you're so good at what you do, and you're not wrong. You are not wrong at all, by any means. But, at the same time, you know, I do want to explore other things. You know, I want to explore other styles, other stuff, you know. I want to be able to do different things in my life because for me with music I kind of feel like I've already done everything that I've wanted to do in music and this final album that I'm going to be working on is kind of like you know it's my send off to say hey I've done something I've spoken about everything that I've wanted to speak about you know I've done everything that I could have possibly wanted to do as far as you know music goes I've done a dubstep album I've done hip hop songs I've done remixes out the ass I've done all kinds of music 
I've done classical shit. I've done rock. I've done metalcore. I've done all kinds of stuff. And for me, I kind of feel like this final album is like, hey, I've reached the point that I've wanted to reach in music. And for those that do enjoy my music, you know, they'll get to listen back at everything I've done. And they'll have that music with them, you know what I mean? For my final album, it's going to be all original, dude. My final album is actually going to be a punk slash indie rock style album. I see one for an all wheel drive. Nope. <laughs> Jesus loves me. And plus, honestly, by doing that. And plus, by doing that, by getting away from the music for a bit and, you know, whatnot, like, by retiring from the music, I'll actually be able to open myself back up to being able to do streams like this, you know? I'll be able to sit down and do more streams like this, and I'll have more time to do stuff. You know, I'll have way more time to sit down, plan out streams like this, have fun with you guys, and just chill, you know what I mean? Download a few tunes here. No, I am not. That literally was them taking a video of mine and doing something with it. That's what that was. They literally, whoever put that up, literally took one of my videos and, you know, stitched it to that video, which I'm not necessarily okay with, but, you know, what can I do, you know? Like, what can I do about that, you know?
Because I got some, man. I want to be able to do my stuff in peace without being attacked, you know? And I just honestly feel like me retiring from music is a good thing. Because like I said, that'll give me a chance to do what I want to do. Now give me a chance to explore other options, you know what I mean? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I went too hard on that corner. That was my bad. Okay, I need to move the steering wheel a little bit because this thing is like over here and I'm over here. There we go. Bite it on that one corner, man. Oh, it's 360, that shit. Let's go, man. Dude, I don't care about what other people are going through. Man. As far as people like Kim go, I don't fucking care. The only thing I care about are my people and my fans. And my friends and my family, and that's it. That's all I care about. I don't care about what King Cobra or whatever, whoever else hates on me does. I don't care about that. Right, it sucks that he's going through that, but you know, what am I going to do about it? Like, what am I supposed to do? What am I gonna do? Maybe magically wave a wand and get his bearded dragon back? No. Sorry, the whole life don't work like that.
it wouldn't surprise me, you know? It is what it is. And thanks, man, I appreciate it. Because, see, this is what I truly enjoy doing with my time, man. I enjoy sitting down, sliding around, having fun. This is what I enjoy, man. Doing my artwork and doing shit like this. too much power behind that last slide. Oops. Oh shit, 360. Oops. That was an accidental 360 though. That was not on purpose. I mean, hitting these 360s today, man. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Dude, this mountain is very unforgiving. I'm not gonna lie. Dude, I keep going too hard on that inside, man. Whoa! Save it! 
Or may not. Oh, Steve Holden wants to tame them. Yo, Blackbird, what up? Want to think, what up? Not too bad. Hey, Force Oil, what up, dude? But like I said, man, you know. Like, as far as me doing music goes, man, I've had my fun, you know. I've done my thing, I've had my fun. And for those that have helped out, I'm glad that I did get to help them out, you know. I'm glad that, you know, my music got to help those that it got to help. And now that I've done that, I just kind of feel like, you know, I just kind of feel like it's my time to you know, move on to other things, you know, do my artwork, you know, and show the horrors of, you know, what goes on in the world through my artwork, you know? Oh god, this is gonna be a cool, cool man, oh shit. got full backwards on that. Not good, not good, not good. Save it, save it, save it. Thank you. That literally just bounced me backwards. What the hell? This car wants to get wild today.
how I saved that slide, I'm back there, I don't know. But I fucking did, man. That was skill and luck. Mostly luck, though. That wasn't luck, though. Spun that shit out. No, my go to car is usually the 86, but I kind of wanted to bust out the 180. My go to car is usually the 86 Chileno, but I kind of wanted to bust out the 180 to see just where I can get it as far as tunes and shredding goes, you know? Oh shit. Guys, get on and get on the Thank you. Almost freaking went off the mountain. That would have been all bad. for going down the mountain. Whoa, where did I even end? Yep. And we're going off the edge. Yeah, let's bust out the 8-6. Fuck it. Yo, darn thing, I do all kinds of stuff, dude. Like, I do everything from hip hop, uh, DJ work, EDM, dubstep, rock, metal, classical, all kinds of shit, dude. Like I said, dude, after this album, I am retiring because I did everything I wanted to do in music, you know? I've literally done everything I could have wanted to and more. What is YZ West? Oh, fuck. I hate this course. The one course I'm not a big fan of. Yeah, close it out. Okay, cool. It's not that I hate this course. I'm just not a big fan of it. Because for me, this course is just too small and tight. But we'll run it though.
And that's all I mean, and that one corner is awkward as fuck. So I mean that one corner right there is awkward as hell to run. Well as for these corners man, I can just run these all day. That corner is awkward as shit. We did get 190k out of that though. Oh, I know, and that's why I tried here because I have the, I actually have my H6 tuned for a toge course. That's why it's so awkward. Because I actually have it tuned for a mountain course and not regular. You know, ripping down a fucking mountain or down a regular drift course. And more specifically, I actually have a tune for Mount Akina. Which, if you guys don't know, is actually my home course. That's where I actually learned to drift. Like, this is actually my first real drift course where I learned to rip back in the day when I first really got into it. See, I've been tuned for more of this style right here. Whoa! Damn, dude, where the fuck you come from? Out the way, homeboy. Damn, that dude came out of nowhere. Dude, it literally came out of fucking nowhere, man. Can't get too wild right here. Bro, I just literally busted a 360. Or oh, that was more like a 720. Oh, oh.
Oh, that kind of set me off guard. This is more tuned for mountain racing. I don't know too greedy on that. I got way too greedy on that corner. Ah, I hit that damn guardrail. What you got coming down here, man? That switchback's a freaking pain, dude, and that's why. Dude, I threw that way too hard, man.
turn on to I got this off on Amazon for stupidly cheap. This isn't anything like my Pro setup. I do have a Logitech setup, like Logitech G920 setup, but uh, right now my pedals are not working, so I have to uh, go out and get a new set of pedals for that. Good job, boys. What's up, guys? A tandem going, boys. I got this on Amazon, I think, for like 80 bucks. So you guys a tandem train going here, boys. <laughs> oh, you fucking prick. Really, bro? Really? That's right, I'll catch your ass. Fuck that wall right up there, catch your ass. Oh! Yeah, that didn't turn out well. Oh, hold this guy down to the pavement, though. Oh, man, I didn't catch him in time. Shit. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. Thank you. But also, this is a controller-based wheel, too, which is really cool.
guys, uh, this is a control base wheel, which does mean I have a little bit more control, but not much. But it's still a good one, like, if you guys want a good wheel to start out with, and you really want to get into sim racing, and you want to just get the feel for how a car works, or how controls work, definitely grab you up this wheel right here, which is the PXN 3100, I believe. It does work on both PC and Xbox, and I believe PlayStation as well. I believe. Oh, 136. Well, like I said, man, I would definitely recommend this wheel setup for anybody just starting out. Do that, like, especially if you want to get into drifting. This does kind of give you that. You know that angle you do only get 90 degrees either way but you still get that motion of you know you still gotta keep control of your car somehow you know you gotta do the motions and it kind of gives you that motion of you know counter steering and how to counter steer or like turning in and figuring out how to counter steer it really gives you that you know that feeling of you know, when your car is going this way, you want to counter steer, you know, whatever way you're going. What other driving games do I play, dude? Uh, BMG Drive. Um, on Xbox, I usually run uh, Forza Horizon 4 and 5. But I do mostly 4, just because 4 is a lot more fun, and that's where I started. Um... And believe it or not, this wheel setup is actually what I ran when I competed back like two or three years ago when I was competing in the Formula One, the Formula One 29, F1 2020 uh, competition. And I actually took home a few wins that season. And the two most important wins for me for that season were when I actually won a race during that during mid-season on my brother's birthday who sadly passed away from lung cancer in 2015 um, I actually won my first race of the mid-season on January 23rd and then on later that week I won it on the 31st which is my mom's birthday the 23rd being my brother's birthday and the 31st being my mom's birthday. So I literally took two wins back to back throughout that course through that spot, which was a lot of fun. Because I'm not, the reason why is because I'm not running my regular race rig. This is literally an arcade controller based wheel. So I don't need the, the belt. I only use the harness setup from when I'm running my Logitech G920, which like I said, right now that's out of commission because I need to get a whole new uh, pedal set up for that, but once I get the brand new pedals, I'll be set. Then I'll start using that again. I just got to get a brand new set of pedals. 
I use the uh, the harness setup whenever I'm doing my my actual sim rig setup. But right now my sim rig setup is kind of out of commission at the moment. But once I get some brand new race pedals, then I will be set to roll. And then I'll start using that again. But for right now, I'm stuck using this beast. Which I don't mind. Like I said, this is what I started out with. I mean, it's a give or take. It's literally one of those, you know, win lose situations, you know. In a sense, I get to go back to my roots as a driver and reteach myself and relearn. But at the same time, I'm giving up, you know, being able to know where. The cars as far as force feedback which I'm okay with because you know this actually makes me run the basics like it literally will make you run the basics of you know steering shifting all that the only downside to this wheel rig I can say that there is is you can't map this and this down here separately because I do have a regular gear shifter down here and then I have my paddle shifters up here. The only bad thing is you can't, you know, map them separately. They're both, they, they basically both do the same thing. Like, see? Right now I'm yanking the regular hand shift. And then, right here, Paddle shifter. That's the only downside is that I don't get to map those separately as much as I wish I could. I unfortunately don't get to do a separate mapping for those, which, like I said, does suck. But, you know, it's worth it. It's all good. Goodbye. Sorry, this is a troll free zone, buddy. No trolls allowed. I swear to God, one of these days I'm going to figure out a way to do some scrolling text across the bottom that says, No trolls allowed. This is a troll free zone. I swear to God. Just wait. One of these days I'll figure that shit out. Just wait. One of these days, I will figure out how to do troll-free zone. No trolls allowed. If you are a troll, get lost. You know, let's do a time attack here. Let's see what we can do for a time attack. And also, in case you guys are wondering, that is my next goal for this game in particular, is to get the, um, the time attack car pack. Either that or build my own time attack. Holy shit! Dude. This thing can freaking get it, man.
to Dancing Hall's ass. Yes, I can take another ride. Dude, that thing is quick, though. Hold on, let me do that one more time. Let me see if I can get that gold, man, because I was hella close to getting that shit. Not bad though, not bad. Yes I did, and I did get the money, man, and I appreciate it, dog. Bro, that thing's actually surprisingly fast. I'm not gonna lie, bro, that thing's quick. Holy shit. I knew the 86 was gonna be fast, but goddamn, that thing freaking hauls ass, bro. Holy shit. Alright, now, let's see what other cars we can buy here. Because we do have a good bit of cash here. We got a fair bit here. Mm. Wait, when did I get the Siberia? Wait, when did I get this? Sweet. I'll take it. <laughs> Bro, why did I get a freaking Subi? Oh, that looks clean, bro. That look, bro. That looks. Oof! That's clean, dude. Bro, we're going for that shit right there, man. That shit looks clean as fuck. Whoo, some of these tires are expensive, bro. You know we gotta throw these on, bro. Can I do an engine swamp yet? No, I can't. Bro, you know as soon as I get the chance, man, I'm doing that ultimate swap, man. You know, let's do a time attack with this. Let's see how this thing does as a time attack. Because this does have a time attack arrow kit here. So let's see how she runs. 
And bear in mind, this is just pure stock. I'm not the best, but not bad. And y'all don't know how to roll doing time attacks, so... I swear to God, if this beats the 86, I'm actually going to be impressed. But it was close. That shit was close, dude. That's actually not bad. That is actually not a bad car. I like that. Let's see how this thing does with. Let's see how this thing does with a time attack, real quick. Knock that out and get some more pointage up so we can actually do a proper build on the Subi. Ooh, right off rip, this thing's quick as fuck. Okay, this thing just might stand a chance at getting the gold medal on this. Oh yeah, we got this. I think I got this. Bad though. Things got a little bit of get up and go in her. Things definitely got some get up and go. Oh, you know we gotta do the Navarro base. Navarro base is actually one of my favorite courses to run for drift traps.
Whoa, 360 that shit. Yeah, we got this. Is there a multiplayer? Yes, there is. There is most definitely multiplayer, dude. Alright, now we can build up our Subi. Hey, thanks, Derek. This isn't one of mine that I built. I will be doing some, some livery designs, though, on my own. I will be doing some live uh, decal designs and livery designs for you guys to download for sure on here. But, now that we have that knocked out, Let's go here, ultimate, and let's do a time attack build. Go to modifications. Oh damn, they actually got a lot in here, holy shit. Power Drift Pro. Yo, they actually got a drag strip on here. A dragger. Yo, Rally Drifter. Let's fucking go, man. That's all wheel drive. That's my style right there. If y'all don't know, man, I absolutely love doing rally racing, man. I absolutely love it, bro. I actually do compete in uh, Dirt Rally 2.0 competitions every year. The only reason why I'm not able to do it this season is obviously because, well, my Xbox account got fucked with. So now I have to wait to get it back. Which means I won't be able to compete this season. I'll have to wait till next season. Which is fine, you know. Yo, they got some baby driver shit, bruh. We gotta do it. But we are going to go in here and we are going to throw on Well actually first I want to paint up the wheels I want to do these just solid black Just give it that solid black look, man. Make it look super clean. There we go. 
Now let's get this puppy, man. Bro, this thing actually looks clean. Like, I cannot lie, this thing actually looks good. Yeah, well, let's hit up West Coast Arena, dude. West Coast Arena is actually the course that I wanted to drift on on here. Oh, damn. Hello, sir. Going sideways, son. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, dude. My bad. I got to talk shit. What up, dude? What's good, man? How you doing, bro? Bro, you, dude just literally press on the other side of the map. What the fuck is wrong with you? No, do not win. Do not win, you motherfuckers. Yeah. How do you like that, asshole? How do you like that? Bro, we got a bunch of ramblers up in here. Freaking missed. That was actually clean. Yo, somebody fucking clipped that shit. Cause homeboy fucking missed me coming through there. Now that we got our points, we can actually go in and do some other shit. 
But bro, that fucking missile on that was clean, dude. That was actually sick. Dude came around, I just ripped it, man. That was actually clean. I'm not gonna lie. That was some straight fucking baby driver shit, man. I just fucking ripped that shit. Oh shit, we're running the same ride. Let's go, dude. Oh, 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 oh. Not good, not good, not good, not good. switch out tunes real quick man because that thing is that tune is not good that is not a good tune bro I mean, it's good for time time but it's not good for sliding Now let's try this out. But first, we are going to switch out the body kit. If I can. Shit, I can't do that yet. Fuck. Oh, we'll, we'll leave it like that for now. Well, 
Ooh, you know we got to hit El Tommy Road, bro. Tommy Road is actually one of my top favorite vanilla game base mountain pass roads on here. Oh, that feels better. Oh, yes. Swing drift ability, baby. Really, dude? What? You know what? Fuck you, dude. Y'all don't want me on the mountain with that car? Okay, cool. That's alright. <laughs> I'll just switch your cars and fuck you. Bro, that looks oh nice. Now this one I can drift with, man. This one's a fucking slider. Let me see what tasks I can do here. Tandem single player drift needed. Ah oh, man. I ain't even close. We got to hit up Evie Sue North Course, son. Shout out. Shout out, Sam. I swear to God that dude's falling. Oh, God. No wonder. We got a troll up in the mix, boy. We got a troll up in the mix, son. Okay, motherfucker, I see you. I see you, motherfucker. Just when I say I'll find your ass and I will block your bitch ass.
Oh, man. I know what you're doing, motherfucker. You're watching my shit. I know you be watching my shit, motherfucker. What's the matter? Well, Tony lost his lost web lobby on yeah, me. Fuck you. You can't drink for shit, homeboy. I'm about to roll my shit. Cause I can out drift your ass on any floor, son. So if you want to get me, oh look, he's here, guys. That's why I'm so far ahead. He's gonna take a while to catch up. That's fine. You know what, let's have a little fun with this faggot. Let's have a little fun with this bitch. Me. Oh well. You had a chance to fuck me up, Troll. I'm out. Peace. I got a tow bit to run, son. Oh, run. Oh, no, that ain't him. Funny man, that dude really thought that he could stop me. Well, like I said, man, I can outdrift any troll on any track any day, man. That is not a problem. Trolls get angry right now, I'm getting sunny. Y'all 
Charles ain't doing this shit. Corner was smooth as butter back there, son. Trying to go to me, bitch. Ain't gonna work. Oh, lucky, lucky. We have a little bitchy bitchy that wants to run me. I bet you I know who that is, CBG. Oh, what's the matter? You mad because you can't hit me, little bitch. I'm going to troll him now because he can't hit me. Ha! Hey, yo, guys, looks like we got a pissed off troll in the midst on here, bruh. And anyone, boy, don't own shit, motherfucker. Anyone boy don't run shit and you don't own shit. So you can tell anyone boy to kiss my ass. Hey, anyone boy, fuck you. 
Oh, trust me when I say, whoever's doing that account shit, I will find you and I will report your ass. Let's see, where is he at? Aww, little boy Wan. Little trolley ran, guys. The little troll ran off like a bitch. Oh well. I'm going with your 15 seconds of fame, coward. Fuck was around with me the whole time. No, I said it's cool. He wants to run off like a chicken shit, that's fine.
I'll sit back up and run and see if the little bitch is out there. I'm not sure, Amy. Whenever I do, I'll let you know. That looks like homie down the left. That little troll gun took off, dude. We have the troll gun took off out of town. He ain't even around. This is me and the other dude. behind closed doors and for good reason. The last time I did a game dev thing, fucking Marty and them decided to try to take the game that I was working on and basically ruined it. So yeah, there are going to be no game dev strings because I'm trying to protect my stuff.
already downloaded this thing. Okay, now we can report this fool. Let's go here. Watch this, y'all. Oh, report. I love reporting trolls, man. It's fun. Guys, okay, y'all, I am about to bounce for now because I am about to chill and do some shit. But uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed this, man. If y'all did, y'all already know what to do, bruh. Hit that like button and all that. You guys know what to do, man. And I'll catch you guys later on because I have a troll to report over on Steam and I got stuff I'm going to be working on. So, uh, yeah. Love you guys. And like I said, I am not going to be doing any game dev streams because I don't want anybody stealing my work. Because the last time I did a game dev stream, somebody did, aka Marty, and all his little friends actually tried to steal my game and I ended up not being able to do anything with it. So there's not going to be any game dev streams. Um, I might do one or two more uh, cover shows and that's it. And then after that, I am going to be retiring from music for good. Like I said, to focus on my artwork and other stuff like that. So, uh, yeah. With that being said, I love you guys. And I will catch you guys later on, man. Peace.